Elections the world over has consequences and consequences for its electorates. This was one of the reasons why Azimio Youth Group in Ghana held a massive press conference to echo the point. Their point is to encourage all in Kenya to vote none other person than for Raila Odinga as the general elections nears. We got up with the convener of the group, Ivan Zosei, and this is what he has to say. Azimio la Imoja. Azimio. Azimio la Imoja. Azimio. This statement is read on behalf of the friends of His Excellency Raila Amuru Odinga in Ghana. We, Azimio la Imoja, one Kenya coalition youth of Ghana, gathered today as friends of Baba, His Excellency Raila Amuru Odinga, known in Kenyan politics as the mysterious one. We express solidarity with the youth and people of Kenya as they prepare for elections on 9th August 2022. The Azimio youth in Ghana still have fond memories of the visit of Baba to Ghana in 2017. We met and had discussions about how African youth would be placed at the center of affairs in terms of governance and socio-economic activities. We were hopeful for victory in that elections, but it didn't happen as we thought. We still have high hopes in Baba. He said, people of Kenya, because we know all too well that the majority of Kenyans, at least about 65%, are in Azimio, just as most progressive African youth who are also friends of Baba. We want it known to all Kenyans that Baba is not only the Kenyan people, Project, but a project of progressive youth in the pan African world. And as such, we are all stakeholders in Baba's presidency as he ushers into Kenya and Africa a second Nelson Mandela movement. Our closely monitoring of the Kenyan leaves with no doubt that in the choice of Baba and Mata Tikit as one reformist, progressive, people centered, approach based, development, integrity, principle inclusiveness, gender sensitive, upholding the rule of law, respecting human rights, and many more modern tenants of democracy. Given the records of Baba and Mata, especially when Baba formed the coalition government with then President Kibaki between 2008 and 2013 as the Prime Minister, we as Zimio youth in Ghana and our colleagues across the continent of Africa are confident that the current high cost of living of the average Kenyan will be addressed immediately by Baba becomes the president of Kenya. Yes, yes, yes. 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 We, the Azimio youth in Ghana, also believe that given the current global economic challenges, the only leader to bring relief to the good people of Kenya is Baba and Mata. They will inspire hope and build confidence for the average youth in Kenya. Again, we, the Azimio youth, also believe that with the personality of Baba, corruption will be fought at the highest level. Unemployment will be tackled. The Kenyan youth will be inspired in realize, to realize this or their full potential. We are therefore calling on the good people of Kenya not to allow any premature propaganda and lies to overshadow the good deeds of Baba. The youth of Kenya must lead the charge to protect the ballot through vigilance. All votes for Baba must be counted and well counted. Elizabeth Fosu, the women's leader for the group, appealed to all women and, and young girls above the age of 18 years to participate fully in this upcoming election to ensure victory. We met Baba in 2017 here in And through our meeting, I learned that he's a good man and he's a man to be trusted as a, couple, uh, as a president. Kenya. So I think if he is being elected to be the president, he can change the Kenya youth for a proper or upgrade them their living standard to a proper level. So I'm pleading with the Kenyans to vote for him to become the president. And vote massively. Yes. To help him to become the president of Kenya. We the youth of Ghana. We stand in solidarity with the good people of Kenya. 
as espoused by our, as espoused by our former president, Dr. Kwame Nkrumah, independence to Ghanaians is meaningless unless it's, it is linked up with the total liberation of Africans. As such, for Africans to be united, for Africans to stand to gain the best in the world, we need to come as a common front. We need to get a common platform that we can share our views. We, the Azimio youth of Ghana, believe that a coalition of Azimio in Kenya stands for the betterment of all Africans, especially Ghanaians. Why am I saying so? For the first time in Kenya history, and for that matter in African history, we have a sitting government, an incumbent, for that matter, pairing up with an opposition leader in the person of Raila Amoro Odinga, the mysterious one, the cat, to champion the goals of Africa. And as such, we believe that as Ghanaians and as youth, our destiny is in our hands. For our destiny to be fulfilled, we need astute leaders, we need dedicated leaders, we need devoted leaders. And that person is Raila Amoro Odinga. We believe, that, we believe that he can stand tall in everything to fight for the, the liberation of Africans as a whole. We believe that as Ghanaians, once Kenyans are happy, Ghanaians are also happy. We stand in solidarity with them and believe that Raila Amoro Odinga is going to be the president of Kenya. His presidency will transcend from East Africa to West Africa and Africa as a whole. Once again, Azimio La Imoja. Azimio. It is our hope and prayer that Azimio government will usher in a second Nelson Mandela movement for all of us. Sure, 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 sure. Our president. We see a landslide victory and we shall be available to join our Kenyan counterpart in the inauguration after the 9th August 2020. Viva Baba Mata Tikit. Viva Azimio. Viva Africa. Asante Sana. The Damase. Thank you. So now it is clear that one little mistake you do in not voting for Raila Odinga will have their consequences for the people of Kenya. Let's not forget the total liberation of Ghana, Kenya and the rest of the world is important to ensure progress and development for our dear continent. Reporting for Wichi 24 TV, my name is Nikoli here in Wichi.